Let me give you let me give you a lesson on race real quick, right? Why's it got to be about race? Because it's always about race, as Mayweather said, right? So this video I'm about to post, I post it to my Instagram, right? Watch the video. It's a screen recording of the comment section. Then watch the clip after that. you don't know that's Dr. Robert Morris. A lot of great information. Love him. I learned a lot from him. However, notice the comment section. Who is this guy? Oh my God, who is this? I need to learn from him. Who is it? Who's that? Oh my God. Oh my goodness. I need to, I need more of him. Who is it? Who is it? Where do I get more information like this? Where do I get more information like this? Uh, I've only been saying the exact same information for over a year and over, have over 5,000 plus free videos telling you the exact same thing. It said maybe even clear in, 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 in an even more attention grabbing manner. But when I post it, Charlatan, who's this nutcase? Who's this quack? He's crazy. Who's this guy? Look at him. <laughs> Look at his hat. Look at his, he has his hat backwards. He's not a doctor. You're not a medical doctor. <laughs> crazy, crazy, crazy. And as I've said in the past, if I was a white gentleman, maybe a little older, wore a white shirt, had white hair, with a little slick back and glasses, and maybe had a plaque on my wall, and was saying the same stuff. Watch, watch how many more people would praise me. <laughs> but because your boy got some tattoos, wears his hat backwards, got a little melanin in his skin, happens to be mixed and not fully white. <laughs> Who the fuck does this guy think he is talking about? You can heal disease. Yo, this is the world we live in. Crazy. Crazy, crazy. And on top of that, everything he's saying in that video, I've said it in my own words. And my video got removed on diabetes. <laughs> but <laughs> I post all the white guys saying today. Take that's on my page too. That video ain't get taken down. It's so weird. Every time I post clips of him, it stays up. But if I post clips of myself or Dr. Sabi, or Dr. Africa, or KT Art Degree, or Dr. Inky, or Polite, or somebody like that who teaches the same shit. I get a lot of reports and my shit gets taken down. Huh. But I know a lot of y'all are gonna be mad at this post. Oh, you think everything's about, it is. It is, 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 it is. and it is. If you don't like that, come on now, you know what you can do. Since I'm cuckoo and everything I say is crazy like that, unfollow, baby. That's all you got to do. Oh, went on top of that. Again. Again. Big fan. He's very knowledgeable. Dr. Morris. Very knowledgeable. Love his information. Watch him at least weekly. That's a fact. But let's also point out the other facts, right? As much as I've been watching him, if you watch him, he posts the same testimonial about this toe he's regenerating for the past five years, Right? And I, I can't find a lot of testimonials from him online. However, on my page, I post a brand new client, client testimonials every day for over a year and three weeks straight. Some dramatic testimonials of people who no longer on insulin, no longer on metformin, no longer have cancer, no longer had to go through chemo, didn't have to go through radiation, no longer have anxiety, no longer on pills, no longer have blood, high blood pressure, no longer have high cholesterol, no longer have high erectile dysfunction. But I'm crazy. <laughs> I can do, all I can do is keep it 100. That's all I can do. I can't sugarcoat shit. I can only tell you what's on my mind. If it's on my mind, I don't want to say it. I'm going to say it. If it offends you, it offends you. But all I can do is keep it real and show you and tell you about what my eyes see, what my analytics are showing me, <laughs> what the algorithm is clearly showing me, what, your, what the comment section clearly points out. Matter of fact, I might... What I'm going to do is, I'm going to take that video of his, I'm going to write down every word in it, I'm going to recite it back exactly right after it. I'm not going to make a new video on TikTok. The next one is going to be me saying the same exact thing. What? What's the difference in the comment section? Everybody <laughs> from fucking Oregon, Nebraska, Montana, Washington State, 
who you can clearly see is 50% body fat in the profile photo, will talk shit on my video, right? They'll talk shit on my video. They'll report my video. It'll more than likely get removed, right? This is a fact. Then some other white TikTokers will do at my video and share my video on their page and talk shit about me. Then even more white people will come to my page and talk shit and tell me how I'm a dumb black moron. Every time. I can only keep it 100. This is facts. This is my, I live this. I wake up to these comments and I look through these pages sometimes and it's the same thing every time. I can, I can only keep it real. These are facts. So I'd like to take this time to give a shout out to all of my white Caucasian supporters who were raised correctly and I don't know where shit. Again, I was raised by a white mother. I'm half white if you didn't know. My father's black. So I understand both sides and I've seen both sides. Okay? I've seen the very racist side. I've seen the very black side. So I understand the different mindsets, different upbringings. I'm not even close to anybody on the white side of my family other than my mom and grandma because I'm pretty sure everybody else on that side of the family is mad my mom had kids with a black person. So again, I've seen both paradigms, okay? Just know I can only speak from my heart. Somebody will reply to some of this story. They'll say, well, maybe if you carried yourself in a more professional manner, if you carried yourself with more class, they wouldn't comment negative things like, oh, if I carried myself more white, if I talked more white, that's what class and professionalism is. Oh, okay. I got you. Damn, I'm from West Virginia, so I'm sure you can hear the country in my voice. I feel like I sound white a lot of the times, but I do got a little slang to it too. I say Joan and Joan and I say nigga sometimes when I rap and shit like and I cuss sometimes. But come on now. Again, I can only I can only be me. I'm not acting for nobody. I'm not putting on no front. If you like me, you like me. If you don't, you don't. But I am gonna call out the truth. <laughs> to all my real supporters out there who rock with me either way. Despite the fact that I went May Wear my cap backwards or forwards below my eyebrows. And I may have some tattoos. And I may have a little tan going on. And my nose is kind of wide. Give me a reply to this story with a fist emoji. Whether you black, white, Spanish. Just to let me know you really, really rocking with me. And it doesn't matter if I wear a lab coat. You understand <laughs> that I'm putting out this knowledge. That a lot of people ain't. And it's hard to come by. And I'm showing results to show that everything I'm saying is actually working for real people all over the world, many different countries. Facts. If you made it this far, just know if you say any weird shit to reply to any of these stories, we will, I will be hosting my 100th annual block party on a Monday afternoon. It'll be like, what you doing double blocked up on a Monday afternoon? Let me also say to some of y'all, many of you in the beginning followed me on here from TikTok because that's where I first got my little buzz. I got over almost 800,000 followers on there, right? Every video I was posting was getting 500,000, a million views, 30,000, 50,000 shares, 50,000 shares within days, right? These are facts. Now, anytime I do a video on holistic health, it gets deleted, banned, or it's shadow banned, clearly. Because again, minimum, I would get 200,000 views per video. Now, every time I post on there, maximum, I'm looking at like 2,000 views. Like, like, how do I got 800,000 followers I'm getting 2,000 views? Come on now. If that, if that, one comment, clearly they're not allowing my videos to be shown to my followers or anybody on the For You page or anything, which clearly I had the whole algorithm figured out to where Everybody would see it. Everybody named Mama and y'all know it if y'all been following me for a while. But now when I post, nothing. So I said, let me test this algorithm. Let me see what's going on. Let me test my page because my last few videos, again, barely got a thousand, two thousand views. If that. Notice again, if you're still following me on TikTok, I don't post as much. I was posting like three to 10 times a day on TikTok. I stopped because I realized I'm wasting my time. My videos are clearly getting banned. They're getting taken down. I'm getting, I got my whole page taken, but they gave it back, right? So... Today, I said, you know what? None of my videos get more than 1,000 views anymore. Crazy. When I go live with 800,000 followers, 
never bought a follower in my life. When I go live, 10 people on my live. <laughs> what? Doesn't even make sense. So I said, you know what? Let me see something. Let me post this old video of this white guy on my page that is clearly shadow banned. <laughs> Bang. Go look at the views. I posted it today. It's already at like 30,000 views. Come on now. Am I tripping? Tell me. Am I tripping? This is the sad reality. I was about to delete my page because I'm like, oh, maybe my page just doesn't work. It's shadow banned. They ain't letting me get none of my shit off. They ain't making sure nobody on the For You page sees my stuff. Nobody on the Explore page. None of my 800,000 followers can see my stuff. I might as well just leave my stuff. Let me make this post to this white guy. Boom! Pages spark back up. So maybe just between every video, I'll just post somebody white saying the same shit as me or something similar. And then maybe, maybe my page will get back popping again. Crazy. I could go on forever. How? Is Dr. Sebi gone? We all know the, if you know that story, you know the conspiracy behind that. You know what happened with that, how you put him in horrible conditions in a jail, right? We know what happened with that. Father Africa's gone. Many other lesser known holistic killers that just so happen to be black are gone. But Dr. Morris is damn near 75 years old. He got a YouTube channel where he goes live every damn week telling you I cure AIDS, diabetes, uh, type 1, type 2. It's easy. Here's how. His shit ain't censored. His shit ain't banned. He's fully functional. He ain't never been arrested. He ain't never <laughs> had no issues. <laughs> wow. It's amazing. I'm done because this could be a, this could be. I'll upload this to my YouTube. For any of y'all that want to rewatch it, share it, and I'll upload it as an IGTV video. For any of y'all that want to rewatch it, share some real facts that's going on. That's all I'm going to say on it. We know what it is.